Uh, Mr Mayor, um, the, the, the leaders of, the, of Central London Councils, City of Westminster and Camden, did write to you at the beginning of your term, and in particular they were concerned about PM 2.5. Yeah. So, as you know, uh, they caused the most uh, harm to the development of young children's lungs. Can you tell me to what extent your ultra-low emission zone uh, actually deals with that, that, that um, uh, pollutant? Uh, at all? The, the, U, the ULEs will have a very considerable impact on that part of, of central London, but it will also uh, drive uh, new technology generally in the sense that uh, we think that the impact on the motor manufacturing industry will be very benign and they will want to, uh, to comply with the ultra-low emission zone and so that will have a general effect on, on technology and a general reduction of PM10s and PM2.5s uh, and indeed um, of NOx. Um, in other words, vehicles will move towards uh, low or zero tailpipe emissions. I, I can't give you the figures now, Murad, I, I'm, I'm sorry to say, but I, if, if we can get an estimate for you of the impact of the ULEs on PM10s and PM2.5s, I'd be, I'd be more than happy to do so. But I, I do think it would be a, a, a good and a generous thing if the Assembly were to acknowledge that the work we've done so far in promoting <coughs> clean vehicles, uh, in cy cycling and walking, and all the other steps we have taken, uh, has actually reduced uh, these uh, particulates uh, by 15%, which is a considerable okay, achievement. Okay, Mayor, can, I, can I bring you back to your ultra-low emission zone proposal? Yeah. Um, effectively, um, you've, you've, isn't that another example of you kicking your responsibilities into the long grass? You're expecting no, the next mayor to do this in 2020 no, when you've no, got targets for nitro oxide to be done by 2015. Don't, don't forget that this is – you've got to be reasonable, Mara, with I understand where you're coming from. You've got to be reasonable with – you have to deal with it now. You've got to be reasonable with the uh, consumer – and with the motor manufacturing industry. You cannot uh, ask people to comply with an ultra-low emission zone when they do not readily have access to the kind of technology uh, that will enable, enable them to comply. We're calling for, for zero or near-zero tailpipe e emissions. Now, uh, that means uh, moving either to uh, hybrids uh, or to uh, range, range extender EVs, uh, or, to, or to pure EVs, or, or perhaps even to hydrogen vehicles. Now, uh, that, that, is, that is going to be something. Uh, the technology is there, now. But, it, but it is very, very important that we don't, uh, we don't uh, insist on uh, improvements that the market simply can't deliver, yet deliver for consumers. What we're trying to do is uh, give the, uh, the market, give the manufacturers a sense of London's ambitions and where they've got to be by the time that ULEZ comes in. And uh, that, is, that, is the, uh, that is the fairest way forward. We've done it already with the taxi age limits. We'll be bringing forward further measures to clean up taxis. Uh, but uh, you've got to be fair to consumers and you've got to be fair to the industry. My, my last point here, you do have one power in your hand. Uh, it's changing the specification of taxis. And you've not, you've not used that. Well, the on. biggest source of PM10s has been... Taxis. Okay, uh, you can that's, a criticism, that's a criticism that you're, you're perfectly well. entitled to, to make, that. but I, 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 you, it comes, Chair. I must say, slightly oddly from a Labour Party that did nothing uh, in uh, your eight years in power to set age limits on taxis and allowed Londoners to endure the most colossal belching of fumes uh, from those machines without any improvement uh, at all. Uh, we've now set a 15-year age limit and we, are, and we are about to bring forward proposals that will greatly, uh, that will greatly improve uh, the emissions of, of taxis. And that, and I, but I agree with you about the impact that will have. Okay.